So here is the 10, 10.5 inch BMW F30 for BMW 3. First you can see here, this is the power cable. This is the USB port. This is the card DVR port. Here you can see has the 6 pin round LVDS. Here is the GPS antenna. For the installation, it's very easy. First, take your original string out, and then the original LVDS cable connect here, and here now our GPS slot. And so it's now a cable. The cable are very easy. GPS slot here. The USB here. And. DVR here. This is the AUX extender cable. First, do not introduce. And here is the power cable. Has the male and the female plug. And this white connect to here to offer the power here. So if you take out the original CD radio, uh, there we have an OEM female, uh, OEM male connector. Just like this, connect the OEM plug to here, now female one, and then connect another male connector to the original CD radio behind, and then we work. If your if your car has fiber optic, this AUX extender camera is used. Just connect one side to the power cable here, and another side connect to the armrest AUX slot, and then we work. Okay, so now we just will turn on the screen to show you. Okay. This is now taking the testing platform. We will turn on the video. We will turn on it. One minute. Why here is no signal? Because we just give the power to it and has no CD radio, so no signal is normal, no worry. Press here, go to the aftermarket UI, and you can see first one by one to show you the music. When you press music, you can see, press here, you can choose to use the USB, SD card, local, different resource. Okay, go back. And here is the Bluetooth. Here you can dial the number here and uh, can press BT music to play the to have the music of the phone. Here's the navigation and the DVD DVD is not active so has nothing here now. When you press original car, press it. We go to here. Oh, go back. Here, if you just press here, you can log into now work our live Wi-Fi and then we work. Okay, go back. And the video. Video here because we set the one one setup I show you. We show you first. Go to setting up and to go to the system. Video while driving back, click it. And then go back again to press it. You can see video can be displayed. Even when you drive your display. Press one time for screen. Here is the PIP function, you can see. Okay. So the DVR is not used now. Setting, you can see here has the language of the setup. Three for here. And this is the time setup. And the audio. The system. System, you can see most of is about the video play when you drive and the rear view camera. If your car has no camera, you use the aftermarket. Then click here. If your car has camera, 
then click here. If you want to install the 360 camera, press here. Okay. The more settings you can see, just like a cell phone, you can see when you check the. If you want to have the language, check here. Here, the language has many. You can see, check. Many languages. Okay, go back. And the system information are very important. You can go to the factory first. The code is one three one four. Need then the aftermarket setting and the count type. You can choose the correct card to different string. Because now our screen can fit to different models, so choose the correct one with us. And for the APK installation, choose here. This is the way of the installation. Okay, go back. To navigation, we didn't show you. Now show you. Press here. You can set up the navigation. You can choose the map as you want. Here, you check. Press one time, one more, and then choose OK. And uh, if, if you want to install the ICO as we want, APP here has the uh, here. From here, you can install some app check. Document app. Okay, just show you here. Go back. And uh, dashboard. Dashboard shows some kind of information here. Okay. And the phone link. You can choose to use Android or iPhone. Android has the USB and Wi-Fi, and the iPhone only can use the Wi-Fi. Okay, go back. So, and sorry if you are interested, just contact with us.